Welcome back to our channel Just Australia. Today we are diving deep into a topic that's got international students and graduates buzzing Australia's recently announced migration review. Whether you're dreaming of studying in the land down under or already calling it home, this review has some major implications for you. So buckle up, because we are about to break down the key changes, when they will be implemented and what they mean for your future. Note that these measures are designed to ensure that the student visa program is used for its intended purpose education, not a long-term stay in Australia. Before we get into the video, subscribe to our channel for more news on Australia visa and immigration. Without further delay, let's delve into the video. Let's talk about the elephant in the room. New Genuine Student Test The biggest change is the introduction of the Genuine Student Test. This new test aims to ensure that students genuinely intend to study in Australia and aren't simply using the visa program as a backdoor to permanent residency. While the specific details are still under wraps, the government has hinted at considering factors such as a student's academic background and qualifications, the relevance of their chosen course to their future career plans, their financial capacity to support their studies, their ties to their home country, this means students will need to paint a clear picture of their motivations, goals, and financial situation to succeed in this test. Strengthening graduate visas. Next, we have the revamp of graduate visas. The goal here is to ensure that graduates find jobs that utilize their skills and contribute to Australia's growing economy. Here's what's changing. Increased English language proficiency requirement. The IELTS score needed for graduate visas will rise from 6.0 to 6.5. New pathways to permanent residency. Specific visa categories will be created for graduates with in-demand skills, offering a smoother transition to permanent life in Australia. Incentives for employers. The government will encourage businesses to hire skilled graduates through various initiatives. These changes signal a shift towards attracting and retaining highly qualified graduates, who can contribute to Australia's long-term economic growth. The review also tackles the issue of permanently temporary residents, international students who stay in Australia on student visas for extended periods without transitioning to permanent residency. To address this, the government is considering measures like limiting the number of times students can apply for subsequent student visas, requiring students to demonstrate that any additional courses they take are relevant to their original degree and career goals. These measures aim to ensure that the student visa program is used for its intended purpose education, not an extended stay in Australia. Impact of these changes. While these changes might seem daunting at first, they ultimately aim to improve the integrity and efficiency of Australia's immigration system. By attracting high-quality students and graduates who contribute meaningfully to the economy, Australia can continue to thrive as a global education and immigration destination. Implementation Timeline The Genuine Student Test is expected to be implemented in mid-2024. Changes to graduate visa pathways will likely be phased in over a longer period. Thanks for joining me today. I hope this video has provided you with a better understanding of Australia's new migration review. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more informative content like this. Until next time, stay curious and keep learning.